So I got the ca I got the Camry out, the Bass Pro. And I think I'm gonna bring the Menards out today too, but right now I'm thinking, should I put a brushless system in here or should I just leave it brushed? Cause I do have a bunch of 2S batteries now that I've turned all of my drums into brushless gear. Except for the Mojave and like another brand of these two guys, this and the Menard. This is the first rip, first time bringing it out. I want to show you guys how it ripped because I never brought one outside to rip it stop. I it in the power and stop, but I never brought it outside to do anything. So here's the first rip of it. This is the Camry right here. Another 19 car. Let's see if it do a spin out. A little, little power. But not like, not how the brush is going to spin all the way around. I guess these guys is cool to be running around the track 2S like this. They're not that fast, they're easy to control. You don't need a gyro when it's only 2S and stop like this. So I think I might leave two like this just in case they come out with a race class. I'll be able to race. I took my eyes off for a minute, slopping at a beast. You see that? I took my eyes off slopping at a beast. Ran up on the curve. Yeah, no, it, it did it by itself. But I heard it's pretty, you know, it's go about like 21, 22 miles per hour. Stop like this. Mm. I don't got my GPS with me. But, um, these some cool little rippers to just rip outside. But for me, I need more speed than this. That's why I went with um, 3S. But if I'm doing some racing, maybe it'll be a little better. To be a little slower because faster is not always better if you can't control it even with a gyro <laughs> yeah see, it'll do that but with the with the 3s system if i tried to do that this motherfucker this thing, it'll flip over this thing will try to flip over i like how it take off too though even the brush this is my first time driving the brush outside driving one of these two like, Driving on the interior brush, because I drove it in the house a little bit, driving it around a little bit. I was driving it a little bit out there. Let me try to get a little. All right. Also, oh, my God. Yeah, that's, that's kind of sweet, though. 19 Bass Pro. And I know some people probably say, how you grab four of them when the bodies are coming out? Some people don't even know the bodies coming out. I'm telling you, the bodies are coming out. And they're going to cost $51.99 plus tax. And then um, these all are the same platform, so you can just buy one car, really. I'm just telling other people, you can buy one car and then just buy all the bodies or buy the bodies that you like. And you can switch your car up every time you drive. It's going to be the same. It's just like going to buy it. There's nothing different on them. The wheels all the same, everything. Only thing that's different is the body shell. And that's they're about to sell those for $51.99. Yeah, $51.99.99. $51.99.99 plus tax. Uncle Sam won't hear it. But I bought four of them because I might want to have my bros or my family or something play with them. You know what I'm saying? Let's, let's go race these around a little track. Might build a little track. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Asphalt, though. Like this. Not no dirt. Some asphalt just like this. This is what they do the best on. On your street right here. On this asphalt. That, you know what? That looks real familiar. You might know what I did that with? The big arm. Um, that truck. That, with that felony. Mm -hmm. Shit jumped that little same thing, didn't it? Mm -hmm. At a higher speed. It ain't hurt this guy, but the bottom of the um, the splitter, I know it got some little... Scratches or yeah, something. Yeah, because it's plastic. 